reasons why I've always loved the character was he had a, an unbelievably strong moral center and compass. And by virtue of what he did for a living, he was put in situations that that center and compass would be tested. And he never really won. In the effort to save 100 people, he might be responsible for the loss of 10 people. Uh, that's not winning. And I think audiences, and certainly I did, really felt for the character that was put in that position. And I think certain people in our world are actually given those jobs, whether they're in the armed services or police officers, firefighters, uh, huge sacrifices. And I think we have great respect for those people. She's had some trouble. She became anti-government and is working for and become kind of a Snowden, Assange type character. Her and Jack are not uh, seeing eye to eye when they meet up with each other. She's kind of over him and he doesn't really quite understand what she's doing, but they're drawn together by circumstances, of course, and forced to uh, kind of work together. Oh, not a chance. The reason why I won't give you a single embarrassing thing about Mary Lynn is because she's vindictive and she's mean as a snake. She's one of the funniest people I've ever known and she will slay you with her wit and I'm not gonna afford the chance. He's really sweet and sensitive. When you said that, I was like, he, there, you can't embarrass him. The guy like does crazy stuff and everybody knows about it. He's so everything out there. So I think the craziest thing would be how sweet and sensitive he really is. Most recently, Breaking Bad, I think, kind of along with everybody else, I really, really love that show. The Wire was one of my favorite shows. I'm not the most technologically savvy guy, so I would actually have to make sure I was home to watch it. I remember kind of changing a lot of plans to watch The Wire. Laying phone cable in Northern Ontario. It was